Swiss beats. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we got some dogs, dogs in the building. Dogs, 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 Con Artist Collective in East Village is like a gym for artists in New York. I'm Ashley Carson, and I'm a jewelry designer. Financially, it's you know not nearly as expensive as what having your own studio would be, and then you're in solitude anyway. So when you're getting started out, it's kind of nice to uh, network with other artists. To gain access to the shared studio with all these functions, you will have to pay two hundred and twenty-nine dollars a month. What about renting a studio on your own in this neighborhood? One thousand dollars at least. Yet, according to the collective store manager Brendan Wiscover, this is not the real beauty of their philosophy. We're really trying to establish an open community, you know, a place that's more visible. So you get together, and if you've got an idea that inspires others, it can get done. Jacqueline Valaga, a special effects makeup artist, values this kind of communication. Just kind of being in the presence of other artists, it's really motivating. It kind of gives me the drive. However, 50 artists working in the same room is not always perfect. Sometimes、uh, the downsides are like tonight. I came in and I had a deadline, and everyone wanted chit chat. There's a party tonight, and you, you know you feel kind of rude not being able to talk to anyone. But you know I came here to work. It's it's hard to focus when it's social. Xiao Tianzhang reports for Reboot New York.